Making an infographic is really easy in Adobe Express. I'll show you how to make one like this in just a few steps. I'm Phil Palin, a brand strategist, content creator, and a proud Adobe Express ambassador. Hit subscribe to get more helpful tips as part of a series. Now let's jump right in. Adobe Express is awesome because it's simple and easy to use. It's the perfect tool from Adobe for anyone wanting to create an infographic. Maybe you're creating one from scratch, in which case I'd recommend starting from one of the awesome templates in Adobe Express. You can also turn an existing image into an infographic, and that is what I'm going to do. Starting here from the dashboard, I'll select an existing project with an image I'll turn into an infographic. By the way, in another video using the same image I showed you how to add text to photos, we're going to build on that in this tutorial. If you're curious to check that out, I will link to it somewhere on the screen. Infographics, what are they? Well, they're a visual representation of information. I'll pull up some templates again quickly as an example here. They're popular online because they present data in a memorable, easy to digest kind of way. Graphics help humans absorb and remember information presented, and they don't have to be overly complicated. That's what I like. You don't even need to be a graphic designer to be able to pull these off. You just need a great idea in Adobe Express. Let's start with this yoga image, which I grabbed before this from the Adobe Stock Collection, which has millions of awesome images that you can use. Let's position the image so that I can add text around it. I'll adjust this as my design comes together. This simple infographic will educate the viewer about the benefits of yoga, okay? And I'll title this soon to be infographic accordingly. I'll add text from the text menu. And there are many beautiful styles and fonts to choose from, which you can always edit or adjust on the right-hand side menu. I'm liking how this is looking. So I'll duplicate this style by selecting the duplicate icon. You'll see me use that a few times in this tutorial. I might even add a shape behind the text so that it pops and you can easily grab a shape from shapes on the sidebar and style it accordingly. Love that feature. So what are the benefits of yoga? I can think of six things, so let's incorporate those into my graphic. It can help reduce stress. I'm loving how this looks, by the way. So I'll group and duplicate this text and shape combo by selecting the group and duplicate icons and continue updating the text and place them around. What else does yoga help with? Improved strength. go. It also benefits the heart. Relaxation. Back pain. And it eases arthritis. Okay, there are my six. Now I'll make my last few adjustments to this design quickly to get things balanced and looking awesome. And there you go. That image just became a simple infographic in a few minutes. That's how easy it is to create an infographic, in this case, from an existing image. Simple. Next, I'll demonstrate how you can integrate text into this photo like this. It is easy and it's fun. That video is coming up next in this series. Hit subscribe so you don't miss it. If you've got a question, pop it in the comments below. We're happy to help. And I can't wait for you to try Adobe Express for yourself. Don't forget to stay tuned to this channel for more actionable tips weekly to create more, create better, and create faster. I'm Phil Palin. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video in this series.